Today was our second FGM conference in collaboration with Bernardo's and the National FGM Centre and the Local Government Association and Hemraj Gold Foundation were really proud to support this event. Today was about highlighting some of the psychological and physical impact and complexity of FGM. We tend to look at what physically has been done to uh, young women uh, or, or women and girls who've experienced this but actually I suppose it's a bit like an iceberg you can tackle what you can see but actually what you can't see there's a lot more depth to. So it's really a, an important day to share knowledge and to share understanding around FGM and why it's a safeguarding issue and how we could work better together. I learned so much. Um, I think it's especially really important to spread the knowledge and spread the word within communities. I think a lot of people don't realise how common FGM can be. It really empowered me and inspired me to like get on my Facebook Live and when I go home and try and speak to the people from where my parents are from in Sierra Leone and try to share awareness about FGM why it's wrong, why there's no real benefit, medical benefit of it being done to children and young women and how it is abuse to women's bodies. I think what was um, the most interesting about the people that were there was the realisation that this is something that happens across cultures. It happens in London, it happens in all parts, all around the world and it's a global fight we should be protecting our bodies and not allowing people to have a misunderstood conception of beauty or acceptance or of womanhood and to use that misconception to endanger young children's lives. We didn't only have people who are like-minded, we had um, people who were questioning whether or not FGM is something that actually happens in the UK. And for me it was really good that we got an opportunity to bring people from who had, have different views and understandings and responses to FGM together so we can start to create that dialogue and have that conversation. It would be great if people went away today and shared the conversation that we've started around FGM and other faith and belief child abuse. You guys really need to come next year because there's a lot of work to do but you've got people here who want to help the cause.